This is Striker Avenue with how the fuck did I fail number three? So you have those moments where you just outright fail, your team fails, or somebody else near you fails. Well, this is the sports edition of that. And uh, so this is basically like how the fuck did I die, except, well, you can't die in football, but that guy can get tripped. On the offensive side. So yeah, not only did I get an interception, but I tripped the guy that was the intended receiver. So here we go. This is how the fuck did I fail. Number three, sports edition. Oh, what a cluster. Uh, yeah, this is, it's obviously Madden NFL uh, 2016. Um, I mean, have you ever seen this big of a clusterfuck of people going for the goal line and jumping all at the same time? It just doesn't seem realistic. I mean, the animations of people getting up and interacting with each other, uh, it was really disappointing this year. But yeah, that's... This is what it is. If they can, they at least so here we are in uh, that struggle NBA 2K16. Uh, yeah, this game ended up being more simulation than I wanted. You'll see that update required. You probably have recognized that. I'll talk about it more later. But yeah, this it, it was real difficult for me. I had a hard time. That's me hitting the wrong button. That's uh, That's a fail. So yeah. Here we are, back in Madden. So all I want to do is just tackle the kicker. I mean, you know, they, they got their point. Um, I usually try to do this in every Madden ever since, uh, probably ever since NFL Blitz came out, almost. But here I am. Just glide right off of him. It's pretty hard to uh, do it because usually the camera obviously follows the ball. Oh, well. Number three. Here's the number three slot. It's actually the uh, the opening cinematic for Madden 16 itself. It just looks goofy. Here he comes, mouth open, coming right at me. And this has got to be the most retarded thing I've ever seen. He squats, takes a dumps on the field, and then he fist bumps. Yeah, that's pretty dumb. Continuing in number three slot. Uh, I catch the ball and I go over my opponent's back and obviously that's not a fair catch. Yeah, this was Super Bowl 50, the uh, Cowboys versus the Vikings. Uh, it's a beautiful shot. But yeah, it's, it's not in bounds. He's an idiot. He fails. Super Bowl 50. You have to look it up sometime. It's definitely worth a game watching, you know. It was snowy that day too. Uh, if you if you couldn't remember, here I am looking at uh, some Viking butt. This uh, I end up well, he catches it. I end up tackling, but uh, this tackle ends up in an immediate fail. You'll see why. Thunk, that's a fail. Uh, it's these animations. That's why I'm t man. You think Madden would get some stuff right? This stuff didn't happen in the 2K games back in the day. As soon as he tackles, he gets up in a weird way and thunk right into the ground. It's just, I don't know why. I guess he was unbalanced or something. Just, God, so dumb. And that's what we get for Madden and not having anybody to go up against the almighty juggernaut of Madden. Number two. Here we are in Madden again. Different game, though. Uh, Cowboys and the Packers. You know, they they always have their uh, yearly rivalry. Uh, here we go. This is actually a pretty good catch. It's pretty good. The guy misses. He loses his footing. Unfortunately, apparently he messed up my footing because I can't get back into play. So I stop. Try to get back in. The guy's there. And then two guys come in, and you'll notice the two guys coming in aren't trying to actually tackle me. They're just trying to make sure that uh, my head gets grinded into their junk. Just like that. Hey, Bill, what do you got in front of you? Oh, it's some other black guy. I'm just going to dive. Good job, Bill. Uh, so, and this is what it's like playing Madden now. It's, it's tons of little imperfections. And the number one, it literally is the entire halftime report for my game of 2K. 
So the update required, obviously you need an update, but it doesn't tell you that until you get into your game. And in order for you to get the update, you have to go to the main menu and load it up, but otherwise that stays on the screen the entire time. Milwaukee came out looking very confident. Uh, the mission to dominate early was accomplished with a spirited 14 to 4 run to start. Yeah, just listen to the Good commentary. Them all around as they controlled the tempo, leading by 14 at the end of one. <laughs> and in quarter number two, it was all hands on deck, and what a show it was! Quality execution, good efficiency, some tremendous defensive play helped them take a decisive advantage, and they're running away with this one. Kenny, your thoughts uh, on the Bucks first yeah, if I was playing as them, that'd be pretty good. I'm playing as the Heat, though. And the entry feeds were on time and on the money. And there you go. There's your ultimate fail. That's the number one slot. Um, have a happy Christmas, I guess, if you're getting this around that time. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much the ultimate fail. That's what I get for trying to play it like an arcade. Uh, it's a good game. It really is. But I just completely blew at it. So, yeah, check out the game. It's pretty fun, but otherwise, you guys take it easy, uh, and thanks for watching.